My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. What's going on YouTube? Caleb Grams. Uh, today we're looking at a car that's been highly requested by some of you. This is our 66 Shelby Cobra. Uh, it's a unique motor cars Shelby replica. Um, it has just under 1,000 miles on it, 920 to be exact. It's a very fine quality build uh, for these Shelby cars. Personally, one of my favorites in the showroom. If you've been enjoying our videos, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on that bell icon. That way you get notified when the newest ones get posted. For more information on the vehicles, like our write-up description and the full photo shoot, you can visit volocars.com. Uh, you'll see, again, all the descriptions on not only this car, but a couple hundred, both modern muscle and classic cars. They're all for sale, volocars.com. Well, let's get into this Cobra a little bit more. So it's made by Unique Motor Cars. Again, it's a family run, pride and joy business, kind of like ourselves. They've been around since the late 70s. Um, they specialize in these kits. Now you can buy them as a complete kit and then you later on, once you get the kit, um, you'll put your motor and trans into it. Um, so it's fully professionally built in their factory. This one was, this is the 289 Roadster body style. Um, they make some of the most exact um, to the original Cobras that are out there available. Um, this is painted in a Viking blue color, guys. This paint job is phenomenal. It's slick, it's glossy. It looks like it just left the showroom floor and it only has thousand, under a thousand miles on it. Um, everything is next to immaculate on this car. Um, I don't see any paint damage anywhere. The chrome's in fantastic shape. The quick jack bumpers are powder coated in a gloss black. That way, if it's chrome, they're not gonna pit. I really love how they add this additional lip on here. They do a little bit different of a body style um, than some of the other kits out there. These ones look really good. Um, they do a really great job on it. It has authentic two-piece Compomotive wheels um, with BF Goodrich G-Force performance tires on them, guys. Those wheels and tires have under 500 miles on them. The car and the rest of the kit has under um, 1,000 miles on it. It does have Unique's custom side pipes for the 289 Roadster. So it starts out as a four to one header and then goes into the one piece side pipe. The headlights are excellent condition, the turn signals, everything works on the car. We tested it earlier. Earlier, You'll see in the video later. Um, on the 289s, the bell mouth, the mouth grill here is a little bit smaller than the other 302 427s. Um, let's see. The doors open pretty nicely. I did notice on this side, the door hinge is a little loose, so we'll have to adjust it and tighten it. It does wiggle a little bit when you close the door, so we will go ahead and fix that. Um, the glass is in really great shape, guys. The windshield wipers do work. It has brushed aluminum bullet style uh, passenger and driver side mirrors, as, long as, as well as the rear view mirror. Um, it does have the side bar brace that goes all the way extending into the passenger floor that is um, exclusive, or not exclusive, but that is true to the original Cobras is what I wanted to say. In the trunk here, it does have a nice trunk stand to keep it up. It's fully carpeted, nicely done. We did just replace the battery, guys. We put a brand new Red Top Optima battery in. It, it does have a, a battery tender that's connected to it, so you can keep this thing on a charge. Very nicely tied in. The hood opens nicely. It does stay up with a hood pop here, so it's not on hinges, but looks nice. Um, you can showcase this car. All right, guys, this thing is peppy. We're looking at a 351 Windsor block with Eidelbrock aluminum ported polished heads on it. Uh, it has an Eidelbrock intake, Holly carburetor, Canton oil or Canton racing oil pan. It does have an external oil cooler. There is a Griffin 
um, aluminum radiator with an electric fan on it. You do have a toggle switch on the inside here in the engine bay, or in the uh, cockpit, sorry, to toggle the, the fan on. Um, again, their kits are come, they come completed. They're powder coated from the factory. It's done very nicely. Um, it's very nice and tidy in here. You definitely can pop this when you're, when you're at a car show and display this proudly. Um, it does have power steering as well. It has a, a power steering rack. Guys, you gotta look, oh, let's talk about underneath. I forgot about that. It's on Willwood disc front brakes. Uh, the rears are, I don't think they are disc. I think they are a drum style. Uh, but under, underneath is fully powder coated. Um, it does have a independent rear Jaguar style dual suspension. It's on coilovers. This thing rides fairly smooth compared to some of the other Cobras out there. It does have limited slip in the rear end too. Um, so this thing really rips. It's mated to, the engine's mated to a Tremec five-speed transmission. Uh, it shifts nice and tight. We're going to play a video uh, of us driving it in a little bit. You'll see this thing is ready to rip. Easily one of my favorite Cobras that we have in here. The interior is done very nicely from Unique. Uh, they use a high quality leather uh, to replicate the seats. They are matching factory. All the gauges are correct to the 289 Cobra. It has a nice wooden steering wheel. Um, from what I remember, all of the gauges worked when we were out driving it. I will make sure and confirm um, later on that they do work. Um, it has a nice carpeted uh, tunnel here. You can take the cover off. Um, it has four point harness seat, seat belts in here to keep you nice and snug. There are some unique motor car floor mats. That's kind of a nice tie. Uh, you got some side pouches if you need to keep your cell phone in there or some small belongings. The e-brake was a little loose. I do remember that. Um, it seemed like it only wanted to catch at a certain angle. Um, so we can take a look at that as well. You have RPM gauge, water temp, oil pressure, oil temperature, your, your fuel gauge, you have your voltage, and then all the way to the right is your speedometer. It's a little different to get used to because you have to look over to see how fast you're going. Um, all the gauges in here, or the, uh, the toggle switches are working. There's a, some, a toggle for the lights, for the defrosters. It does heat up the windshield, it, that does work. You have your wiper, wiper blades, the toggle switch for the fan like I was talking about, and then your flashers. Both the turn signals work. Um, this is just, again, very nicely done. Guys, we're going to take a spin in this Cobra. Easily my favorite one we have in the showroom, guys. This has a 351 Windsor block in it with Eidelbrock high performance heads. This thing's pushing a whopping 410 horsepower, made it to a five speed Tremec transmission. This thing is just a blast to drive. All the gauges are all matching. The RPMs are over here. Now you do have to get used to the, the speedometers over on the passenger side. So if you want to know what speed you're going, you do have to look over. Um, that's just how they do it on the 289 body styles. It is true to the, the original Cobra. Oh man, listen to that engine purr. The turn signals work, guys. Look at that, we're 
we're doing 60, no problem. What a fun car. Shift's really great. There's no grinds, no clunks. Drive straight as an arrow. It does have brand new uh, wheels and tires as of 500 miles ago. This is just a very, very quality build. Good job from Unique Motor Cars. All right, guys, that was my impression of the 66 289 Unique Cobra. I had an absolute blast, even though it was a little cold out. It was well worth driving this thing. Tons of fun. Um, if you're interested in purchasing it, you can visit bolocars.com. You can click on that Buy It Now button. Um, it'll take you through. You put in your information. You can secure a deposit on the car. That way you're the first one to get it. Um, or you can give us a call. Ask for me directly. I'm more than willing to help you out. I can get you set up with financing if need be. I can get it shipped or set up shipping right to your door. Again, visit bolocars.com. But hurry up and do so because I might buy it before you. But thanks, guys.